Wait, I don't know. Oh. Oh, I don't see any way to... Oh, shoot. I don't see any place to disable this. What was that? Oh, gosh. Alright. Of course, we'll take the poultices and the money. It's still... Okay, well, we're not gonna worry about that. Dead herlock? As you say. The only good herlock is a dead herlock. Saving game? Alright. We're saving as well. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Should we go straight across? Over here, over here. This is gonna be a mess. This is gonna be a mess. Let's just go over here first. See if we can find anything good. So far, nothing. I shall do it. Anything here? Okay. All right, let's go. Let's just get it over with. Let's do this. Let him funnel through. That's wrong, 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 wrong. All right. What we got? Sapphire, demonic, ecor. I have no idea what that's for. Maybe that's for like poisons and stuff. Hmm. Spear thrower. I want that. Dwarven massive armored boots. I feel like Ogren would. Forge master's hammer. Oh my gosh! What can I get rid of? This stuff can go. Destroy that. That can go. This can go. This can go. Alright, we're gonna take that. I'm gonna see what Ogren has on. They probably it probably wasn't even worth. Probably was not even worth. A little bit. He still looks like a box of crayons. I don't have anything else to slot here for him either. All right. We 
eatery. Oh, what's over here? What do we got? Yeah. And that's a fractured stone, so we know what's in there already. All right, let's... I don't like the lag. I shall do it. Don't need that. It shall be done. Sure. All right, so across the way. That wasn't as bad as I thought. It wasn't, wasn't too bad. Mm-hmm. And we just basically went in a circle. All right. Oh, this is where we were. Or over here, or something like that. One of the... Oh, dear. Oh, holy moly. What is... Suck. Oh my goodness. Yeah, well, you know what? These things can kick rocks straightly. Straightly. I don't even know what that means, but they can. Alright. Oof, look at that texture. Alright, where are we? Runestone. Uh, there we go. Dwarves and the Unknown Burden. 512 Exalted. Yeah. The surface declares the fourth blight, a number that means nothing to the stone. In the depths, the events are inverted, our blight spanning the interim years, seven generations of shifting lines and darkness. Our ancestors are the reason the surface kingdoms don't know a dark spawn by sight, why even their eldest have never heard of, accounting, of an accounting firsthand. They believe the Blights are defeated by a gathering of allies with singular focus. Eventually, they will be lost by attrition in the depths. The, so the spawn surges and releases. We fortify and follow, although doubts are raised. From Chapter 27 of Stalata Nagat, The Stone Unheld, Commentary in the Roll of Years by Shaper Indwin. Okay, so... When was the first topside blight because what they're saying is they their blights so basically they're saying that the top side of the people top side think that coming together and fighting together is what keeps the blights down which in essence it does right but they say this is a constant battle for them i'm repeating myself but this is what they're saying this is gross what the ew Okay. Got a mage. Come on. Ah, grand. Freak it out, grand. Get him, Shale. Oh my gosh. Oops, 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 oops. I didn't mean to do that. 
kind of loot. He's over here somewhere. The man is getting hit hard. All right. What else we got here? Army of the Legion. So now we have to get rid of this. See, okay, Dover Longsword. We don't we don't need that. Destroy that. Take all. We've got more. May this report find the proper eyes to affect future tactics. We found an enclave of the spawn, possibly a breeding lair, but we could make no approach. There were far more spawn they anticipated, and I divided the squad to draw the main body of the horde away. I do not expect to survive, but I have made certain that most of my men will see another day. I am torn by this, as my petition will go unheard, and that may curse many more of the legion that would die here. But I simply cannot abandon the men I have looked into the eye and called brother. Perhaps they will not thank me for this, believing themselves already dead, but where their life is there where there but where there is life there is hope. I will not be the last to see their worth. From the Recovered Legion of the Dead Field Report by Lord Darius Farrell. So the Legion of the Dead, they are Ugh, they already consider themselves to be dead because what they are cast out no longer considered part of the dwarves their lives are dead so therefore the sacrifice doesn't miss I don't know how does this work they're considered dead that's why they call themselves the legion of the dead and so even though they, they make the ultimate sacrifice for the greater good which is to protect orzammar is orzammar the last of the dwarven kingdom First that's day they come and catch everyone This is nasty. I don't need that. Okay, I don't need that either. Second day, they beat us and eat some from meat. Fifth day, they return and it's another girl's turn. Sixth day, her screams we hear in our dreams. Seventh day, she grew as in her mouth they spew. Eighth day, we hated as she is violated. Which way am I going? This way? Oh, more spiders. What? Is dead. Okay, it's up to you. I am. There's two mages. Okay. Okay. I hate mages. Oh, don't you dare. your body over here with the spiders dear sir that almost never happens. you are worse th you are worse than Alistair 
Alistair can least stay alive now. You! I, I'm regretting taking you, to be fair. But it makes sense that you went. So, there we go. But let's save. See if we can hear some more voices. Is this the way we went? Right? Wait. Oh, shoot. Which way was it? Is this it? I don't remember. day she grins and devours her kin. Now she does feast as she's become the beast. First day they come and catch everyone. The men are all not on again. Fourth day we wait and fear for our fate. Fifth day they return and it's another Shh, eating. Sixth. What is this? A human? Bland and unlikely. Feeding time brings only kin and clan. I am cruel to myself. You are a dream of strangers' faces and open doors. Examine her closely. She appears to be suffering from a high fever. Her skin is pale and she is covered in dark blotches. First day they come and catch everyone. Is this darkspawn corruption? It it looks different. Corruption. The men did that. Their wounds festered and their minds left. They are like dogs, marched ahead, the first to die. Not us, not me, not Laren. We are not cut. We are fed. Friends and flesh and blood and bile and and all I could do was wish Laren went first. I wished it upon her so that I would be spared, but I had to watch. I had to see the change. How do you endure that? How did Bronca endure? Are you from Bronca's house? Do, do not talk of Bronca, of what she did. Ancestors preserve us. Forgive me. I was her captain. And I didn't stop her. Her lover and I could not turn her. Forgive her. But no, she cannot be forgiven. Not for what she did. Not for what she has become. What did she do, Hespeth? What did Bronca do? I, I will not speak of her. Of what she did. Of what we have become. I will not turn. I will not become what I have seen. Not Laren, not Bronca. Uh, where did she go? Oh, she's... What the heck is that noise? And where did she go? She became obsessed. That is the word, but it is not strong enough. Blessed oh, stone it's two of you. Left in her. Great. All right, let's go. Oh, jeez. He went down pretty quickly. Did he? Yeah, he's dead. Oh dear. More doors. Sure, I'll take that. There's a door. This door is locked. 
Yeah, I can't get you there. Omnia store. Ominous. We tried to escape, but Omnius. they found us. They took us all. I can read. Turned us. Hello. Boonamar. I thought I would have fallen into dust by now. Friend or foe? Bonamar. Is this a tie? What the heck is this? What does he mean? Can I talk to you? Stop Ogre? wasting okay. time, Warden. I'm not here to chat. Legionnaire Altar, Legion of the Dead Relic. The Gag Shade. The Gang Shade or Gag? I don't know. The stone is a will that surrounds and directs. She guides even when we are willing, willfully blind to her influence, but she is not pure. The stone bears a corruption as old as balance. For the dwarves to prosper, the gang, the waste and unstable rock must be cut away. But like the stone, the gang also has an influence. Even each of us, each of us must face this, must carve the, each of us must face this, must carve the worst of ourselves away, but the Legion of the Dead bears a unique responsibility. Only the fully adorned of Legion can face the gang can cut into the darkness that afflicts the raw stone. She encircles us and we must protect her. Where here where darkness re reacts meets light. Can't read today or yesterday or the day before that. The Legion of the Dead inscription undated. Okay. Now what is this? Legion Altar. Legionnaire Key. Helm of the Legion. I'll take that. I'll take that too. New quest, the dead cast. Friends have argued long, but I would propose a different direction. It is not unprecedented. Uh, no, we read that. Casualty. Darius Ferald, lieutenant, found dead with his squad. The corpse was left untouched, suggested the Darkspawn feared his spirit even in death. Mm. His ferocity defending his men was corroborated by survivors before they succumbed to corruption. If it, it is rare for a soldier's actual death to exceed the honors given at his enlistment, but Ferald was an odd one, an agitator. His eccentric promises were disruptive, and I fear his death may demoralize more of the Legion than actually heard his fantasies firsthand. He was committed to the stone with his insignia. As honorable a burial as we can manage with a spawn at our backs, our heels, at our backs, our heels, same thing. But officially he has formed a second front. Better his foolish hopes are diluted by time than killed outright. From a bi-weekly casualty report by Sergeant Unger. Okay. So we have another Legion of the Dead. I wish I could like, loves of diligence. Mm. Well, of course I can't use these wise. Augurin can't use these either. Gloves, boots, chest. Do we have a do we have a helm? Helm of the Legion. Is this is this it? Okay. So we can wear the helm. So we've got all the pieces then. And we fight. Oh, that, that did nothing. What is this? It shall be done. Legion of the Dead Relic. What? Agrin, can you touch that? Okay. I don't know.
All right. Well, the men they kill, they're merciful. The women, they want, they want to touch, to mold. Where are we supposed to? Oh, can we go this way now? They took Laren very well. They made her eat the others, our friends. She tore off her husband's face and drank his blood. Three twenty five towers. The surface kingdoms declared victory. The horde is crushed. The push halted, and the celebrations begin as humans think the skies and their maker. Beneath their gaze and their feet, the darkspawn retreat to the steps of our tigs. New front lines are drawn across old. They settle in to breed. The memories say as happened twice before and likely in the darkness before that. From the chapters 14 and 17 of Salata Nagat, The Stone Unheld, a commentary on the role of years by Shaper Erden. So, yeah. We celebrate a victory, defeating the Blight, yet here, in the Tigs, there is no victory, only a continued war. Shade, she grew. She swelled and... Deadcast insignia. Turn gray. Hold the phone. What is this? If proven, the lineage of dead cast house symbol could lead to the Legion of the Dead being considered as a form of noble house on its own right. It must be entered into the memories and the shaper if the validity of the claim is to be tested. A. They remade her in their image. Then she. Yeah, I don't. I don't need she that. Made more of them. Hmm. Brood mother. She's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oops. Is she? He? Broodmother? Broodmother. Is she? Oh. Okay. All right. Um. The tentacles? Are we? Let's kill her. Does she like fire? Oh, she's got me. She's got me. It is begun. I'm dead. Somebody got me. Right. Okay. Let's see if that helps. I don't want to get too close to her. Can we? Okay. No, that's. What? Oh, lovely. Ads first, boys. Well, here we go. Oh, I shall do it. 
These guys. Oh, jeez. But the true abomination is not that it occurred, but that it was allowed. Branca, my love, the stone has punished me, dream friend. I am dying of something worse than death. here except for this so I'm gonna have to all right let's see what we can get rid of dark spawn staff we don't need this I don't think um probably not the shields we probably don't need these so I'll take that and I'll take that and I'll take I can't take that okay mmm is there anything that I could give? Search for the true prophet. I don't. I, uh, so right, let's get rid of that. Take this. All right. Now, come here, Ogren. I think I might have something for you. Natural, yeah, let's take that. All right. Anything else to loot? The heck? So where do I go? Over here? Save it. Um... What does she mean, dying of betrayal? Anvil of the Void. Who did she betray? Branca? Her people? Anvil of the Void. Area unlocked. If Branca is anywhere, this has to be it. She will not be unprepared. Are you friend or foe up here? What was that? Foe. Let me be blunt with you. After all this time, my tolerance for social graces is fairly limited. That doesn't bother you, I hope. Well, shave my back and call me an elf. Bronca, by the stone, I barely recognized you. Ogren, it figures you'd eventually find your way here. Hopefully you can find your way back more easily. Ooh. And how shall I address you? Hired sword of the latest lordling to come looking for me. Wow. What is the only one who didn't mind Ogren's ale breath? Be respectful, woman. You're talking to a Grey Warden. Ah, so an important errand boy, then. I suppose something serious has happened. 
Is Enverin dead? That seems most likely. He was on the old and wheezy side. Hmm. <sighs> Osmar needs a new king to defend against a blight. He is dead, yes, and the assembly is deadlocked. I don't know. What should I say to her? No. Osmar needs a new king to defend against a blight. He is dead, yes. Let's go with he is dead. Then what is your involvement in this? Why would a surfacer be interested in dwarven politics? Why would you I? You must have a patron. A highly placed patron. And they must want something in particular. Excuse me. Now, what might that be? I don't care if the assembly puts a drunken monkey on the throne. Because our protector, our great invention, the thing that once made our armies the envy of the world, is lost to the very dark spawn it should be fighting. The anvil of the void. The means by which the ancients forged their army of golems and held off the first archdemon ever to rise. It's here. So close I can taste it. So okay, but of course there's a catch. The anvil lies on the other side of a gauntlet of traps designed by Keradin himself. My people and I have given body and soul to unlocking its secrets. This is what's important. This has lasting meaning. If I succeed, the Dwarven people benefit. Kings, politics, all that is transitory. I've given up everything and would sacrifice anything to get the Anvil of the Void. Before we continue, I'd like to discuss the, the, the pile of flesh with the ten nipples that I just fought like two minutes ago. What was that? What did you do? Does that include Haspeth and the others of your house? Yeah. Enough questions. If you wish me to get involved with this imbecilic election, I must first have the anvil. There's only one way out, Warden. Forward. Through Keridan's maze and out to where the anvil waits. What has this place done to you? I remember marrying a girl you could talk to for one minute and see her brilliance. I am your paragon. Okay, well. She said it, folks. She is his paragon. She's not mine. Um. Okay, let's. Oh, wait. She said there's only one way. Can we go this way? That is one massive lava liver. Lava liver? Lava <laughs> liver. What? Alright. She said this is a gauntlet of traps. Dwarven corpse. Wow. I needed people to test Keridan. It is begun. Traps. There's no way to break through except by trial and error. I sent them in. Pledged to be my house, and they as did you say, didn't want to help. They tried to leave me, even my Hespeth. But even she couldn't understand that when you reach for greatness, there are sacrifices. Mm -hmm. As many sacrifices as are needed. Uh -huh. It shall be done. Okay. Here we go. Very well. <laughs> to me. 
She swore she'd do whatever it took to find the anvil. There was no other choice. Most of them were dying of the taint already. It's a gauntlet, okay. Still going. Well. Still talking. All right. Oh, jeez. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Away with you. Oh my gosh. A waste of time. Oh, that was nice. Easy work. Gollum. Very well. Joe, why are you such so much smaller than the rest of these guys? All the columns I've seen tower over you. Why are you so much smaller? See? Look at how big this one is. There's another one. And another one. Oh, saving. Whoa, 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 whoa. Gas valve. All right. Yeah. Stay here. Nope. 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 Come with me. Come with me. Come with me. Get the, get, get these. Okay. We gotta close the other ones. Are these gonna come alive? It 
So, okay, that did it. All right, let's see what you guys I got. Plated armor. It is begun. Mm. I'm afraid to go over here. Very well. Are y'all gonna come alive? It shall be done. All right. Ooh. Saving the game. What we got? Where? More golems. This. Okay. As you say. Look there. A cunning trap. Yeah, I see it. And okay, it's just he's Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Ain't dead. Ain't dead. Oh. Get up. Get up. Get up. Can I not get up? Okay. I can't get up. Why can't I get her to cast the spell? And we're down. Oh wait, she's still alive. I'm so dead. I am so dead. Ah, uh, I can't. Seriously? Oh dear. Tell me about it. As you say. Does she have no, she does not. All right. Let's heal up. I, where, how do I, how do I get, uh, I was going to say, how do I get out of the state? As you say. Okay. Where's Agron? Come on, Agron. Get your butt up. That was rough. I had no idea how to get out of the feigned death. I'm not doing that again. That was stupid. That was stupid, stupid. All right, save the game. Yikes. Oh my gosh. All right, are you guys gonna come alive? You you two are. Okay, no, I'm sorry. Whoop. Ogren's dead already. This is ridiculous. Oh my 
my gosh. survivability here. None. Not a dang. Just not even a piece. Alright, this I'm so glad to get out of there. This looks so cool. Look at that. And Wow, look at that. Is that lyrium? Because these things are lyrium. So this must be like raw lyrium. All right. You know what this looks like? You ever, see, ever played WoW? There's a boss that has like multiple faces. Okay, how am I, what am I supposed to do? I'll kill these guys. Easier said than done. Jeez. Really, you need to stay alive, buddy. So what am I supposed to do? Oh. Okay. Am I supposed to just like, I see. I see. Is there another one glowing? Man, drink up, get from over here. Akron. getting stuck here.
Do I wait? Why are you guys stuck? Okay, it has to be on the right side. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Alright. It is. I have no idea what I'm doing. I am done. Oh, okay. Blast. What am I supposed to be doing here? Oh my gosh. Agren. Now what? Is this? The task is finished. Oh my gosh. How many more of these must we endure? Don't give them the Jeez. Good work. All done. <laughs> Marvelous. Okay, well that was a pain in the butt. I don't even know if I knew what the heck I was doing there. Which way did we come in? This way? The, yeah, I don't know. This way. I don't ever want to do that again. Saving. Saving. Alright. 
And, uh, friend or foe? My name is Caradon. Once, longer ago than I care to think, I was a paragon to the dwarves of Orzammar. Caradon? The paragon smith? Alive? Ah, there is a voice I recognize. Hmm. Shell of the House of Kadash. So he knew Step Shell. Step forward. You know my name. Is it you that forged me then? Is it you that gave me my name? Have you forgotten then? Ah, it has been so long. I made you into the golem you are now, Shale. But before that you were a dwarf, just as I was. The finest warrior to serve King Valtor, and the only woman to volunteer. The only woman? A dwarf? I laid you on the anvil of the void here in this very room and put you into the form you now possess. The anvil of the void. That is what we seek. If you seek the anvil, then you must care about my story or be doomed to relive it. Hmm. You made the anvil, I take it. Though I made many things in my time, I rose to fame and earned my status based on a single item, the Anvil of the Void. It allowed me to forge a man of steel or stone as flexible and clever as any soldier. As an army, they were invincible, but I told no one the cost. No mere smith, however skilled, has the power to create life. To make my golems live, I had to take their lives from elsewhere. A dire shortcut. Was it worth it? So said my king. I had only intended to use volunteers, but he was not satisfied. And soon a river of blood flowed out of this place. Finally, it was too much. I refused. And so Valtor had me put on the anvil next. Oh my gosh. What now? Do you want revenge? Not revenge. The blow of the hammer opened my eyes. My apprentices knew enough to make me as I am, but not enough to fashion a control rod. I retained my mind. You were amongst the most loyal ship. You remained at my side throughout, and at the end, I sent you away out of mercy. I do not remember. We have remained entombed here ever since, and I have sought a way to destroy the anvil. Alas, I cannot do it myself. No golem can touch it. No! The anvil is mine! No one will take it from me! Shale, you fought to destroy the anvil once. Do not allow it to fall into unthinking hands again! You speak of things I do not remember. You say we fought. Did you use our control rods to command us to do so? I destroyed the rods. Perhaps my apprentices eventually learned to replace the rods. I do not know. But if so, then all they need is the anvil to make all the slaves they need. You, please, help me destroy the anvil. Do not let it enslave more souls than it already has. You are a paragon. I'll help if you support a new king. Don't listen! He's been trapped here for a thousand years, stewing in his own madness. Help me claim the anvil, and you will have an army like you've never seen! Franca, you mad, bleeding nugtail! Does this thing mean so much to you that you can't even see what you've lost to get it? Look around. Is this what our empire should look like? A crumbling tunnel filled with dark spawn spume? 
The anvil will let us take back our glory. The anvil enslaves living souls. It must be destroyed. So it fights with Caradin? Good. That seems right. Thank you, stranger. Your compassion shames me. No, you will not take it. Not while I still live. Bronca, don't throw your life away for this. We fight. She's not Bronca and you know. Now stand aside. Can you see she's dangerous? Can't you see she's dangerous? She's not Bronca, you know. Now stand aside. No, we don't know that. Do we know that? No, she's dangerous. She's dangerous. Just give her the blasted thing. She's confused. Maybe once she calms down, we can talk to her. No, Agren. That's not a risk I'm willing to take. Bah! You're not the only master smith here, Caradin. Golems, obey me! Attack! Oh, she's got a control oh, rod. So but, my friend, you must help me. I cannot stop her alone. Does she control you? Oh, jeez. Here we go. Alright, this is gonna be fun. Oh my gosh. gonna say Knocking her over. Oh my gosh. Can I get some lyrium? Here. As you say, 
You don't know what I'm capable of. Let's, uh, first I want to loot, then we'll talk. Let's see what Bronca has on her. As you say. Ooh, Bronca's shield. Very nice. Let's see if we can get rid of, because I'll need that. Take that. Definitely don't need that. Take that. I don't need that. All right. All good. Save. That was a pain in the butt. Alright. Let's talk to, uh, Cardin. Another life lost because of my Garden. invention. I wish no mention of it had made it into history. Yeah, you ain't kidding. Stupid woman. Always knew the Amber would kill her. How is it that the woman was not able to disable me as she did you, Carradin? I do not know. Have you been altered? I once had a pathetic little mage of a master. He did something to me, experimented on me, and then I killed him, and it rendered me paralyzed. Hmm. Perhaps he was bringing forth old memories, and caused you to remember the time when you fought at my side. The paralysis you speak of always resulted when the master perished. As for your free will, you were always a strong woman, Cher. I am pleased to see you remain such. I don't know what to say. Mm. Thank you. Oh, do not thank me. All of this, this is my doing, my legacy. <laughs> but at least it ends here. I thank you for standing with me, stranger. The anvil waits there for you to shatter it. It was good to meet you, Paragon. I intend to ensure that your warnings about the Golems are heard by the Circle of Magi. Is there any boon I can grant you for your aid? A final favor before I am freed from my burden? I need, uh, mm, Agrin? You lost Bronca to this. What do you want? Yeah. I don't suppose you can bring Bronca back. Maybe make her a Golem like you. I would not do such a thing really, to her, even if I could. Somehow I didn't think so. Well, and I don't want anything that would remind me of this. Best it's just done. There is still the matter of the election. I mean, we still need a paragon to get the assembly support, right? For the aid you've given me, I shall put Hammer to steel one last time and give you a crown for the king of your choice.
It is done. Give it to whom you will. I do not wish to hear their names, nor anything more of them. I have already lived far beyond my time. I have no place here. How old is he? I will destroy the anvil as agreed. That would please me. What if I didn't? What would be the outcome? If you have my eternal thanks, stranger. A trust in all Tungsha. May you always find your way in the dark. And there he goes. If he had done this, this. Liberator, that would have been great. That would have been a great little Easter egg. All right, well, that sucks because, you know, obviously he's lived a long time. He probably wanted it to be over with. Uh, he's in, He was entrapped in that body, you know? He said he was forced into it because what he didn't he didn't want to force people to become golems golem registry it is begun you see a large stone tablet shipped with age with a great number of dwarven runes carved into its surface examine the tablet more closely the writing is in Dwarven and appears to be a long list of names, each with the stamp of their house next to them. You recognize few of the house names. At the bottom of the list are the words, We honor those who have made the sacrifice. Let their names be remembered. The carvings are still deep enough that a tracing can be taken. Allow the information to be carried elsewhere. Shale, do you recognize this at all? No. Perhaps it thinks I should. It may have something to do with Caradin's words. If there is some way to make a copy of these runes, I am willing to study them. Perhaps there is something to be gleaned from them. I know not. Take a tracing of the tablet. Sure. Continue. Okay. New quest. Golem Registry. Find someone who would be interested in the Golem Registry. You made a tracing of the Golem Registry that you found close to the Anvil of the Void. Surely someone in Orzammar will be interested in this. All right, let's see what quests we didn't get done here. Mother's Hope, Key to the City. Increased understanding of Orzammar society has revealed a diplomatic cache accessible to the representatives of an assembly. Paragon of our time, with the Paragon's crown in hand, it is time to return to Orzammar to crown her king. We need to go back to Orton Taig. Uh, Golem Registry, Thief, okay, return to the Shaperit. All right, so we need to go back to the Orton Taig, so I think we should go. There's nothing here. Wait, how do we get out of here? Uh, is it this way, maybe? No. How do we get... Do we go back the way we came? I suppose so. I guess. Well, that pretty much beat the sod out of how I imagined it. You ready to head back yet and share the news? <sighs> I want to look around a little bit more. I, I wouldn't be in any hurry to get back to the assembly either. Okay. Codex updated. Agren. Agren enjoys challenging his palate with alcohols of ever-increasing rarity, potency, and outright lethality. <laughs> this has afforded him no benefit whatsoever. So we know he know he he likes the the drinky drinks. So I do want to head back to Orton Tig to see if I can find that um, 
whatever it is for the top ciders and get that finished. I want to leave that un unfinished. Um, I guess we have to walk all the way back for this. You better stay where you belong. I don't feel like fighting anymore. Killed enough golems. This, I have to say, was one of the longest quest lines ever. But I think one of the more interesting ones because Dwarven lore is actually really interesting. And then the simple fact that um, you had, where are we going? Can I, I can only, okay. Uh, this is going to take forever. I'm not going to be able to get, I'm going to have to, let me just, all right, let's just go. Let's just go back to Orzammar. I can, no? Okay. All right. So we're walking back. We're walking back. Yeah. Lovely. How about I do this? How about I come back once I'm back to where I need to be? Once I find the um, topsiders thing, and uh, yeah, I'll be right back. Well, that didn't take very long. Looks like I think I might have found. Okay, moving on. I th okay, I thought I was wrong. I was wrong. I read that wrong. Fractured stone. Where would that even be? It said Orton Tyke. Are we not here? So it's gotta be somewhere close by, I'm hoping. Maybe we can check on old Rocky Boy. Oh, Rocky Boy. Come here, Rocky Boy. Oh, here we are. This is it. Warrior's Grave. I shall do it. Quest completed. The topsider sword has been reconstructed after returning the pieces to his remains. So that's it? Okay, that's it. Don't think we can... Yeah, we can't. So we gotta go back out. We'll leave Ruck alone. Poor kid has seen enough. How he has survived beats me. Like the dark spawn don't bother him. I mean, forget the dark spawn. The spiders. The giant spiders. They don't... They don't... Bother him? Anyway. So, we've got to get back. Talk to... His mother. Talk to the shaper it. Crown a king. And... Oh! Don't we... Have to... Something about, um... Um, opening up a chapel or something like that. Going to the chapel and I'm going to get married. Yeah, I've been recording for way too long. That's the problem. That is the problem. Oh, here we go. Lords of the Assembly, I call for order. This argument gets us nowhere. I will have I order. Tactics. I call for a vote right now. My father has one living child to assume the Idukan throne. Who would deny him that? Your father made me swear on his deathbed you would not succeed him. I apologize for the interruption, Lord Steward, but the Grey Warden has returned. We should let the Warden speak. What news do you bring? <laughs> Ooh. I bring a crown forged by Keratin on the Anvil of the Void. Do I want to say that? For his chosen king? No, because he didn't choose a king, so that would be lying. I bring a crown forged by Keridan on the Anvil of Void. Keridan was trapped in the body of a golem. This warden granted him the mercy he sought. 
releasing him and destroying the Anvil of the Void. Before he died, Keridan forged a crown for Orzammar's next king, chosen by the ancestors themselves. And we are supposed to trust this? The word of a drunken sot and a Grey Warden known to be in Harrowmont's pocket? Mm -hmm. Silence! This crown is a paragon make. Mm -hmm. and bears House Ortan's ancient seal. Mm -hmm. Tell us, Warden, whom did Keridan choose? Mm. He wished me to give it to whomever I chose. A choose. Grey Warden knows nothing about us. Why would a paragon entrust someone like this with such a weighty decision? This is ridiculous! We've argued in these chambers for too long. The will of the Paragon is that the Grey Warden decide. Yeah, because if I gave it to Bellin, he wouldn't be arguing. He would he would take the he would take the crown, right? Then the argument would be over. Right? Right. So I'm gonna give it to Haramount. So I appreciate your forthrightness, Warden. You have acted with grace through this entire torturous process. Watch your back, Haramont. Balin looks like he's about to get froggy. find you worthy. First amidst the lords of the houses, the king of Orzammar. I will not abide by this! Hmm? The ancestors have spoken! Said, so stand down, Balin, you've lost. Would you let a surfacer decide the fate of the dwarves? Watch out! They brought weapons! Guards! We must not take the Here we go. Here Get him. Get Balin. Uh, where is he? I did not think even Balin would defy the word of a paragon, nor that so many would follow him. Mm. But most of Orzammar has seen him for what he really is, and I trust we will bring this insurgency mm -hmm. under control. Show them you are a strong king and they will follow you. I prefer to be known as a just and compassionate king. Strong too often comes to mean tyrannical, but I will not leave this uprising unpunished. Those loyal to the throne will begin preparations for a surface mission immediately. Orzammar will fulfill its treaties. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must get to the palace and set our plans in motion. And I must return to my duties on the surface. This is the staff I carried as King Andrin's second. Oh. Take it as a reminder of your place in Orzammar. Sure. I wish you luck against the Blight Warden. May we foster another four centuries of peace. Your role in this election would Oh no, what what is with this? What what look, look. look at this Oh my gosh. Alright, I I see I see. Maybe maybe if I leave the door, if I just okay. This is this is ridiculous. Look at this. Assembly, cash, key to the city. All right. So what do I have to get rid of something? Okay. Eh. What is? Okay. That that didn't do it. How about that? Destroy. 
All right, we're still we're still over. All right, get rid of that. Now, now we're still over. Gee, Willikers. All right, here I'm out staff. Studded leather gloves. Key to the city. Quest completed. You have found the key to Orzammar. Recognition of your understanding of dwarven society. So what does that even do? You are stone carved, Warden. I've never seen the like. Ah, Cardall. If I'd heard it secondhand, I'd have called it a sodding lie. Warden, we've got a king because of you. The rest, impressive. But the Legion is grateful most for restored leadership. It frees us to fight to the Darkspawn properly. Can I count on you to fight the Blight at my side? Nay, our place is down here. When you break the Blight and you've got the skill, we'll make sure they have nowhere to retreat. Mm -hmm. You'll have us indirectly. Mm -hmm. That's more than any surfacer can say. Mm -hmm. We need your taps now. They need them. Mm, we do, but... We need your top side to show the world your skill. You alone have the skill to back up your words. Each of the Legion owes our homeland a death, but if our lives are better shed on the surface, so be it. Back to Orzammar when we win, though. I'll not stay topside to lose my stone sense. Sweet. All right. Um, I can see that we're not going to fix this. We need to go to the Shaper. <laughs> She's just gonna moonwalk across the. Can I move? Can I moonwalk? No. No. Okay. I thought maybe. Uh, here we go. You found it, Warden. You have my gratitude. You're a bright spot in an otherwise dark time. All right. Let's talk to Orta. Guess what, girl? I, I started to worry. I didn't know if you were ever coming back. Did you find any records? Any sign of the old Orton Taig? I found the records here. You... you found them? Let me see. That's my great-grandmother's name. And her husband! Oh, great ancestors! It's them! It's me! I am an Orton! Oh, thank you! I have to take these to the assembly right away! Find me there! Once these are acknowledged, I'll give you any reward. Hmm. All right. I'm just, I'm not going to even stop it. I'm just going to just continue on. Let's shape her. Impressive work, Warden. King Haramont's impending coronation has been entered into the memories. Is there something more I can help you with? She looks ridiculous. I have some tracings you might be interested in. What's this? A list of names. Most of these clans no longer even exist. Is this authentic? You bet your hairy arse it is. Taken from a tablet in Keridan's fortress, no less. Then is it true? The rumors of Keridan's so-called volunteers? Extraordinary. I would love to make a copy of this. The Shaperit has never had much information on Keridan and his golems, much less proof of this magnitude. Warden, I hope this artifact from our archives will suffice as a reward. I must inform the Shaperit at once. I need to talk to you again. Impressive work, Warden. King Haramont's impending coronation has been entered into the memories. Is there something more I can help you with? Um, I would like your permission to open a chantry here. Ask, and I shall do my best to answer. Uh, that's not what the... the, 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 the. How did the caste system come to be? That is interesting. According to our legends, seven brothers founded our empire. The youngest, Bloodlick was the wisest and was chosen king. His children formed the noble caste. The eldest, Gyatshed, trained his sons to defend their king. They became the warrior caste. Shatyar founded the artisans. Orzatyar forged our first swords. It was Orzammar who dug the mines that became our city's foundations. The twins, Koapar and Nacht, both founded trading houses. But Nacht was wounded in battle. On his recovery, he swore to serve his brother's sons. What about the castless? The castless descend from criminals and those repudiated by their own families, or who chose to go to the surface and live by human laws. 
They have no ancestors to guide them and no families to claim them. They should not have been born. Their parents defied their shame and brought cursed children into the world. It's better they die young. It seems very easy for you to dismiss them. Their births are not recorded in the memories. In Orzammar, they do not exist. Is there something more pleasant you wish to discuss? <sighs> Let's go back to my first question. Please, speak your mind. I would like to permission to open up a chantry. That is an odd request, especially for one so new to our city. Well, I come on behalf of Brother Burkle, a cleric of Redcliffe. I thought so. This is not the first time he's made this plea. Well, My answer to Brother Burkle hasn't changed. So I ask you the same. On what basis would you have me insult the ancestors and overturn 2,000 years of tradition? The Chantry's charities would greatly aid Orzammar. What sort of charities do you mean? The Chantry cares for widows and orphans. Could provide work for the castless as well. Yeah. Traditionally, that is their extended family's responsibility, but sometimes people fall through the cracks. Very well. He may hold a prayer meeting as he requested, if not build a new temple to his god. At least the words would come from one of our own. Now, is there anything more? Nope, that's it. I will record this conversation in the memories. I hope I do not come to regret it. Oh, well. Such is life. All right, let's moonwalk out. Head over to the assembly. I think that's all. Is that it? Mother's hope, lost memories, speak with Orza. Uh, the shaper has granted brother. Uh, oh, so proven the lineage of. De okay, so do I need to go back into the shaper then? Where would I even put that? Shaper? Memories? Okay, quest updated. The dead cast Xandia has been entered into the memories. The Legion of the Dead may eventually be considered a cast or house of its own. Okay, so that was it. Okay, cool. That was it then. All right, so let's get these three things done and then we can kiss Orzammar goodbye. For the most part, I guess. Your butt is mine. Oh, here we go. Don't give them the Still, oh, we got our we got our stature back. All right, it shall be done. Yep, let's go. Anybody else want to challenge us? I'm up for the task. Let's see. All right, Nerev. It's about time the assembly saw sense and put Haramont on the throne. I would say I agree, Lady Dace. We spoke to you already. Of the hour, supporters of disgraced Lord Balin take to the streets. Pandemonium increases by ten percent. Yeah, I have a feeling we're going to be meeting them. Who are you, Lalinar Noble? All right. Ah, uh, see who else wants to fight us in the streets. You'd think they'd learn. We took Balin down. You know. All right, let's go to, oh yeah, let's talk to this lady, Filda. Hmm. 
Hmm. You've returned. With all the excitement over the new king, I never expected you to remember my poor son. Did you learn anything about my ruck? <sighs> oh, gosh. I'm sorry, Brooke's dead. Oh, my poor boy. I, I guess I knew, but I just wish I could have seen him one last time. Here, this is my husband's masterwork, the first shield he smithed. I don't have anyone to save it for anymore. I'd like you to have it for what you risked to bring me this news. And approved of that. Andraste teaches that patience is the child of wisdom, but I'm eager to hear if you've seen the Shaper. He's agreed to let you hold prayer meetings. Oh, praise the Maker! You truly walk in the light, friend. I already found a convert among the merchants who offered his shop as a temporary chantry. It's just by the tapsters. Please, come to our first service. Sweet. Over by the tapster. Where's that? Maybe I have to come back for it later or something. Okay. Um. So now off to the assembly. Is that it? Is this it? Or do we... Proving. So we need to go back up. What is this? This is the... Okay. Back up to the diamond quarters. Oh my gosh. Shale. Seriously, you need to like start walking a little bit lighter, you know, just just a tad. You're a heavy walker. News of the hour. Harumont is king. I just realize it's probably hot as all get out down here. Balin fanatic, and then we must have. Are we at? Okay, we're right here. Hey. And Orta. My name's Orta. After the old Orton house, they gave our seat back, and the records show which houses still owe House Orton money. One day, I will be able to properly thank you for all you've done for Don't me. Don't even worry about it. Discontinue supporting King Haramount. Your happiness is enough. And I don't know what treasure is left. But whatever I get, you can have as much as you want. I'll have to find someone willing to look. Maybe a whole expedition. If the Taig is still there, it must have something. House Orton will not forget this kindness. <laughs> Didn't that sound official? Yeah, but I wouldn't go down there if I were you. Really, I would not. Alright, what else do we need to do? Is that it? That is it. Ladies and gentlemen, we have completed the Orzammar quest line and we now have dwarves in our midst or on our team and not just any dwarves mind you we have the legion of the dead um so why don't we go ahead and make our way back to camp where we will news of the hour all hail king pyral all hail king pyral Haramont. All hail the king. Ding dong, Balin's dead. So that whole house, Iduken, is dead now? Or, wait a minute, the middle son is alive. Whom we haven't met. Um, he was, he was... He was, um... Excommunicated? That's not the word I'm looking for. He had to leave. He had to leave. He had to go. Wherever he is. Makes me so wonder if when, how'd you know so bleeding much about ale? Have some tawdry tale of misspent youth to tell. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing quite so interesting, my friend. The tranquil mages of the circle just happen to be alchemical miracle workers. And they brew more than just potions. There was always a pitcher or two of fine ale at our supper table. Well, bless my britches. 
Maybe when all this is done, I'll chat up one or two of them quiet mages. Uh, tranquil. Tranquil, quiet, insipid. Eh, same difference. It's funny. Okay. Woo! Give me a moment. Hmm. Gave you a moment. Is everything all right? Of course everything's all right. Uh, just give me one sodding moment. By the stone. I feel like I'm about to fall off the world with all that sky up there. Hmm. <sighs> I'll take your time. I need you ready to fight. Is it that strange to you? Strange? <laughs> strange is your wife turning out to prefer the ladies. Not living in a world without a bleeding ceiling. Well, let's get moving. We're losing, what you call it, uh, daylight. Oh, that's right. They would not have the night cycles down there, would they? They wouldn't even know. All right, so can we return to camp? Yes, we can. All right. See if anybody speaks to us. Loading. Nope. Okay. Nothing to see here, folks. All right, we are back at camp, and you know what we do after a major quest line? We make sure that we talk to everybody in camp, so we will do that the next time you see me. Hopefully, that is very soon. Hope you enjoyed that entire quest line of the dwarves. I really did. Um, in spite of my misgivings towards the dwarves, I do um, like that storyline and I love the, the the dwarven the dwarven lore but um yeah that sounded really convincing no I did I really enjoy the dwarven lore and I I think they have one of the coolest areas in the game I think that too in World of Warcraft um or Orgrimmar Orzammar Orgrimmar interesting um I wonder if there's like a a connection there like Orzammar Orgrimmar if that is like a high fantasy type name for dwarven areas i have to figure that out or find that out because they're very similar either way orgamar is kind of built the same way in world of warcraft so anyways um i hope you enjoyed it i will see you guys next time ciao